Melanie Johnson here at the Habitude Warrior. Yes, this is the third day we are here. There are incredible speakers every single day. I'm with Elite Online Publishing, where we make your book a number one bestseller. I want you to try and share this video. Let us know you're watching it. Like it. Um, we just want to share it. I have Stacy Ellen with us today, and she has some amazing stories to tell us. She gave a great speech. Um, she went through a whole transformation, and we're going to talk a little bit about that, and then she's going to tell you a little bit about a great learning experience and how you can end up taking your business to a new level and it's not the way you expect. Stacy, thanks for coming. Thank you for having me. Pleasure to be here. So tell us a little bit about um, how you came about. You, you talk about your inside game versus your business game. Explain that to us a little bit. Sure. So the famous Jim, Jim Rohn says, do as much work on yourself as you do your business. And I fully wholeheartedly believe in this message and it's mostly the foundation of most of my talks and why is that important because everything within yourself is interconnected your mental your emotional your physical who you are it's it's like this <laughs> so whether you're happy or not you know whether you're down or you're in doubt or you're feeling separated from others all of that will show up at any time within your business because because of that. So doing the inner work, you know, really getting to know who you are, your strengths, your weaknesses, uh, what are you passionate about? What makes you excited? You know, even in your marketing, what gets you excited? Because these are the things that you want to focus on in your business and outsource the rest. Yes. <laughs> I love some of that because, you know, a lot of times you don't think about, you bring the attitude in yeah. to the office and what you're going to get accomplished that day. And so many times we don't think about our inward game and being mm -hmm. centered and being the best that we can be. Yes. What's like something you may teach someone like if I came to you and said, you know, I think I'm okay. I do all right. How do you make that shift for me to do that inward game? Mm, that's a great question. The shift, the shift is different for each person. Right. So it really depends on where you are at any given moment in time. But what I always like to do is say, okay, what is the, what is the one thing that you can do today that will bring you joy, that will light you up? And maybe that's giving to others. Perhaps it's just feeling gratitude for something simple. You know, gratitude can bring us right into the present moment right into back into our body so we're mostly stay in our head yeah. and so and and then bring in both those feelings when you're when you're tapping into the feeling amazing things happen people want to be around people that feel good that are exciting and you better believe that your clients are completely attracted to you when you're in this higher vibration and realm and wanting to be with you so as far as one single tip you know we can use gratitude immediately to yeah. flip us back into that place of feel good um, I often say on stage, you can dance, <laughs> get back into the body. I love to sing and dance, and that brings you right back, right back to who you are and standing strong. And even take a walk. You know, nature is healing. You know, getting outside. We're in Boston, though. It's really cold here. <laughs> so I live in San Diego, um, but we travel everywhere with, with the Habitudes Warriors. And, um, yeah, so... Those are some That's, simple tips. But those are great tips. I mean, get outside, mm -hmm. play some music and dance, meaning changing that you're uh, Your physical, phys physical of yes. what you're doing. And there was a third one. What was the third one? Gratitude. And gratitude and being grateful. Yes. And, and I love that you said, um, you know, being grateful for small things. Because sometimes mm -hmm. we get in like, you know, I know myself, I'll think I'm grateful for these big things. But now I'm grateful. Like I saw, um, you know, a bird go. I had a hummingbird that went in my garden. And I was so grateful that I got the opportunity to see the hummingbird, which is a cool thing. So cool. Do you know a hummingbird, just right before I came here today, the hummingbird came and stopped, right? Like three, one, two, three seconds in front of me. And it's beautiful. Beautiful sign yeah, though, right? Yeah, instant, yes. instant gratitude. <laughs> that doesn't happen every day. I can tell you that. There must be a meaning behind the hummingbird. I know, I think so. the hummingbird. Yeah. <laughs> Well, um, she has a special offer for you that you can tap into. Stacey Ellen, tell us about that. Sure. So we've been talking about a lot of ways to get back into that feel-good space and raise your energy. Also, and, and that's one piece of communicating. And, you know, we're always communicating, whether it's nonverbal, energetically, and then the words, right, that come out of our mouth. And so I have a guide that I created. It's called Turn Conversations to Cash. 
And this is really about tapping in and, and really understanding people's nonverbals and how do you also raise your energy. I go through some of that in, in there, as well as there's a five-step instant connection technique where I walk you through ways that you can connect with somebody very quickly in a way that feels good and not salesy and, and not heavy. So that, that is the guide and that can and how be, do we get it? yes, thank you. That can be found at Stacy Ellen. So S T A C E Y E L L E N dot com forward slash gift. Just drop your name and email and it will come right to your inbox. I'm getting one. Put a number one in the comments if you're going to get one and uh, let us know. She would love to see who you are if you're interested in getting her thing. Stacy, thank you so much for coming by. She is always an inspiration. I just love giving her a hug when I see her. She is awesome. This is Melanie Johnson, Sunday at the Habitude Warrior Conference for Elite Online Publishing. Write a book and be a bestseller. Thanks.